Yeah. Well, that's a pretty solid land. Uh, some of the other ones, you need uh, Mentos, you need Landon. Mentos uh, has temporarily has his elite he's, card he's revoked. Temporarily. We know he'll get back in it, but it's like you don't pay your dues for a while, yeah. and then you have club. But his membership's on standby. Uh, uh, yeah, I, not for if you count. I don't even know if, wait, I don't remember if Nick's oh, being Frostbite or not, but that's, that's another one of those. Yeah, he did yesterday. Well, it, well Thursday. It was yeah. a little funky though, because Frostbite was stupid and went wolf until yeah. five. And then I think like typically Frostbite's Roy would beat Nick, but he yeah. like that one game he just got killed like instantly as soon as it started, and then just Nick uh, cleaned up. Like credit to him. So many people like they get a winning position and then they can't convert, but he he can't. And he clearly like has confidence in his gameplay, which is important versus good players. All right, we got Donkey Kong versus Sheik. Now this matchup is definitely dog shit. It's definitely. So Rico does this thing where he kind of decides to not care about he some kinda, matches. He kind of does that. that I talked made. to Andrew though, and he's like, I'm not scared of Rico, only because the matchup is so bad that like, whatever. But now Sheik's at kill percent, and he's eating his words, so we'll see. I think this evaluates as like slight advantage Sheik right now. Well, oh, okay, well, never mind. Got the Phantom Whistle. Ah, uh, the Chunky Kong. <laughs> Actually, there wasn't enough empty movement before the force match for that to Chunky Kong. Yeah. 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 The rendering there not oh. quite out enough. Alright, well, what was originally a great game for Sheik has turned into not a great game for Sheik. Yeah, let's see if he can clean up right here. Maybe not. Though, typically, Sheik has a killing problem. Her confirms work so well on DK yep. that it's not quite as terrible as you might think. I mean, obviously, like, sometimes you'll hit him at 150 and you won't die, but. Yep. It's not like uh, someone tiny and unkillable that you just like no confirm works on ever. Uh, didn't quite drop down low enough for that. Rico is doing some interesting options here. <laughs> attack, attack, spot dodge, goodbye. Yeah, yep. Good DI too, you can have a good DI. Alright. Can Sen stay alive? Negative. It's alright, you know. Rico's been loving that hand slap like over the ledge today. Donkey Kong has so many things where you get hit by them and you're like, why did I get by that? Like, of course he's going to do that. Like, why did I fall for that? And oh, you know he bad. has this option in this scenario and you get hit by it and you're like, what the fuck? Can I do that on the David. stream? I don't know if I can do that. I, don't, I, I hope so. <laughs> I've let it slip like twice already. Yeah. I've been like, oh, whoops. Man Slap is such a weird move. It feels like you should be able to punish it, but... It's so good. Yeah. That's what's so interesting about Donkey Kong is that he has amazing specials. Really and amazing good, normals, and he's terrible. Yeah. His, his disadvantage is just that bad. Like, down B is incredible. Really good move, both on the ground and in the air. Side B, situationally very useful. Yeah, his tilts are all invincible on his hands. Uh-huh, his smash attacks are all really strong, quick, and useful. His back air, obviously, is probably the best in the game. That's really good coverage by yeah, Andrew. Yeah, great. His up air is amazing. His down air is useful. Uh... His dash attack is really, really good. It's like goes yeah. snake distance and sets up for combos and uh, puts people in disadvantageous situations. It's just like all that together, and he's still terrible. He's still not even close to being good. Just his disadvantage is just this. so bad. Yeah. Just someone who just explodes whenever they get it. Yeah. Oh, and punch. Punch like True. one of the best neutral beats in the game. Interesting. I don't know if that's a fair hit. Let's <laughs> get the slow motion replay on that one. Yeah, that was weird ass interaction. Rico loves this platform right now. We've had the weird... Uh, 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 Can't right. be rolling there. That was the ugliest end to a game of all time. Just like... Alright, uh, I'm gonna land and uh, F-Smash. You could have given me... You're going to uh, just vacuum them into that F-Smash right there. So that's one of those Donkey Kong F-Smashes where you're just like, I don't know what he's gonna do, but I'm gonna run back F-Smash. And maybe it'll hit him. And that time, incredibly, it did. And just it's incredible. Just <laughs> like you should ban town against me. Reverse psychology. It works if <laughs> Hey, let him go to town. Looks like we're on town. I know. I know Rico likes town too, but I don't know. Andrew will go to town every single chance he gets, no matter what. All right, and I don't know why. I don't know enough about sheep. 
Yeah, I guess he's I mean, got some crazy like stuff he can do here. Thing. I mean, it gives you space to maneuver, which you want to achieve, especially versus Donkey Kong. This is kind of nice to see, though, because KDK never travels to WoW, you don't get to see him perform, but yep. Andrew does all the time. So we kind of have an idea of how good KDK is, watching how he performs. <laughs> how he performs versus Andrew. Uh, and Andrew's been doing really well recently. So if KDK can take out the W here, you know he's gonna be threatening Raleigh. That's perfect. That's interesting. Whoa, Ooh, dribbled like okay. a basketball. Going for it again? Sneaking through that forward field, getting that nair to the jab. Oh, <laughs> right between the eyes. <laughs> Duff from the right. Face. Yeah. Good there. Whoa, that one, pressure. yeah. Whoa! Alright. Andrew... Uh, Andrew hates winning. <laughs> so... He didn't land either of those, but... And once again, incredibly, it's even. Just because, even though Andrew has sort of command and control of control, the other characters, yeah. he just can't... I can't believe he landed on that platform. That's... <laughs> top five Ooh, horror movie moments. Lost. Yeah. You uh, just can't get these kills. Mm -hmm. And I think versus DK, the strongest thing you can do with Sheik is just use your needle confirms, and he has a needle bouncing fish him at all. He's been charging him up and just not using him much, but yeah, that, that Nair will, will still confirm. That'll get him. That's a big move. You can see, okay, like, one. maybe 30% here. 37. 37. Yeah, not bad. Ouch. Big back here. There to up there. Looking for the other one, but not getting it. Oh god! Ugh. Every time he's on that platform, he's just like terror. Yeah. Pure unbridled terror. Smart recovery. Just going what are you doing? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Okay. Well, he actually died it properly, which is nice. But you can't be doing that. Oh, that above one. DK. Terrifying. Downer. Okay. Wake up, Ford Silk. Andrew might have to use okay. words here. It's not looking good. Whoa! That's the anti chic tech. Just attack at a good stuff. Yeah. You'll get lucky. They'll misplace something. Yeah. Trying to go for that tomahawk, but Rico's not having it. And he's really good at grabbing people up there, which is why I think it's surprising that Andrew puts himself in that situation as much as he does. Now, in this situation, uh, I'm just going to wait for that spot. Now. Just <laughs> There's someone over there. Yeah. Rico found a horse fly. <laughs> That's an annoying thing about playing Sheik. If someone whiffs something right in front of you like that, like you can't just run up and kill them for it or something. You just have to, yeah, you just have settle to for a grab or yeah, like a down tilt. Yeah. Right. It's not trying to punish punch. You want to beat DK, you can't punch punch. Yeah, there's no way. We're gonna be reacting so well to these. All right. Call that a day. Yeah. Well, it's not looking good for our hero. That's <laughs> not online anymore. Yeah, that's just a tech that you have to hit, but obviously Weak. Andrew knows that. Just you don't have to hit it if you're like Mennonite. Yeah. Honestly, you might have been able to make that a Sheik. Yep. Bouncing fish towards the stage, double jump up B. It's possible. Maybe he just conceded. He was like, yeah, I resign. It was like, like, like maybe 30 less percent. So. Uh, Back your hands maybe. Up. Uh, got him on stage. What is he gonna do? Interesting. That's the Raven. Yeah. Donkey Kong's a uh, upbeat himself. Frame four in the air, so it's honestly like it's his fastest combo breaker when he's in there. Yeah. You can use it offensively to try to recover. Fortunately, has nine years of lag on the stage, mm -hmm. so. I think almost all of Donkey Kong's options were used to just waiting, so... Ooh, that was nice. That was a nice interruption. Yeah. So this is the situation you want to Sheik here. You want to be a thousand percent up, nowhere near death, and you want to be running away and throwing needles. I said running away and throwing needles. Will Andrew run away and throw a needle? He hasn't thrown a needle since I said that. There you go. Charge, charge some, please. yeah. Will he throw them though? Probably not. Will he run away and throw a needle? He's not... <laughs> That's a nice instant double jump. You see that? 
That was really good. Got it. But, okay. Is he gonna go for the back air? I think this is one of Andrew's weaknesses as a player, is that he won't play with leads the way that the best in our state do. Like, if I have a lead versus KDK in this situation, I'm never getting near him ever. Uh, Ooh, I take back everything I just said. Yeah. Andrew is the greatest to touch controller. He did it. Yeah. No one could have killed KDK in 81 like that. <laughs> the evaluation for this one is very strongly chic. If Andrew loses this one, it is classified as a choke. A hard choke. Now, he's kind of playing the way I'd like to see him play. Yeah, there you go. He's, he's doing a lot better this game. Just I was, those grabs are such because you're in complete frame advantage there from DK. Like you can you can do anything there. You can attack at hit stun, you can grab him first, but Andrew's just so confident, he's scared his opponent in the shield that he's like, Woohoo! Uh that he's just like I got you. Okay. Oh, oh the, the tips. Oh so, so weird. Of the whirling fist. Oh yeah. Yeah, I got in a fight in real life once and I won it that way. <laughs> just, whirling at my that, opponent, just spinning my arms. There's that one video of like some high schoolers fighting. It's like this dude hit the Rob side beam. The dude just like spins around a circle. And, yeah. Like, hits him like four times. Well, I was in necessity. I was fighting three people. I had yeah. to be defended on all sides. Is the in center or neutral be? Ah, right, this is not a good situation for Sheep. This is like even at best right now. Just don't just let him have the platform. Okay, there you go. So okay. There you go. Yeah. Ow. Well, I don't know. I think that this is enough of an advantage here that if he blows it, it's kind of... Okay. Every every single neuron in his brain should be focused on not dying. Like, in that situation, how do I not get punched? What do I do that gives me the lowest probability of getting Maybe punched? Not throw that up now, that was, like, on the list of engine moves, that was, like, so far <laughs> down the list. That, that was, like, not. quadruple question mark. Okay. Like, the grab. All right, all he just has to do is throw needles. Just throw needles until you can kill him with dash attack. Yeah. He's playing it smart, though. He, he, like, he knows. Yeah. And as KDK, I'm looking at cheese. I got no fear in my body right now. I know that he's so oh, afraid okay. of me. Try to get right. the grab, but... Maybe he should have had a little more fear. Space. If he had a little more fear, he wouldn't have gone for that grab. Yeah. yeah. At least it will not be a shutout for yeah. San Reaper. Our a hero. Four. And we're going back to town. <laughs> Rico's like, all right, I took a game here. I'm not afraid of town. Oh, you want to see if you're on the NC SC Wi-Fi PR? Let's see. Number one is Mortality. Oh, yeah. Number two is Mage Falco. Oh, yeah. Number three is Solo. Oof. Oh, okay. Number four is Sausage. All right, we don't need to read the rest of these. Let's call it there. Uh, Wi-Fi PR, it's so funny. Oh yeah. I, uh, it's not funny. It wasn't funny when it was number one. It was real. So every every other thing though, terrible. I totally uh, at, at class three. I no, and you, oh, oh. no. He's so sad about that one. I right. really is. Well, now he has the plausible deniability. He's like, you never know. If I hadn't killed yeah, myself exactly. there, I could have won the set. Just unfortunately, just have to move on. Just try to do your best in this and be ready for it next time. Yeah, and this, we don't even have to talk about this anymore. It's just sad. Unless Andrew makes like an amazing, ridiculous sheet comeback. It's like, the realm of possibility. Are you kidding me? Against this. Uh, <laughs> you kidding me? You're sheet and you're forced to approach a stock down versus DK with a punch. He's already killed for how the first two games went. It's just like it doesn't seem oh. like it's going to be Oh god! Oh god! Oh god. Oh, oh, oh. Alright, your games, everybody. Unplug the controller. This is where I would click resign if I was involved in this match. It's called a day. Everybody drop shield after punch. Yeah, it's insane. I'm just, just like. Just do something. Get away from there. It's like Rico hasn't been in this state for like, you know, six months. <laughs> Definitely longer than that, but yeah. Hyperbole. Oh, Sasha said he made it all on accident by farming one guy and getting fourth. Well, that's unlike when I got on, which was due to skill and wisdom. But every other one has been terrible. <laughs> oh, this is just like... You've punctured a vital organ and now you're just punching the guy a hundred times. Like, this is like no reason to do 
I don't need the rest of this. What the? Yeah. That's where, like, a commentator like Max Ketchum would be like, I wonder what he was going for there, instead of being like, obviously that was in his input. Like, interesting, uh, interesting yeah, I don't know if I agree with the Ford error there. I am Max Ketchum. I'm good at the game. Yeah, he's okay. Never give up, never surrender. Now, Winston Churchill would design this match. Like, <laughs> he's like, this is unwinnable, guys. <laughs> Uh, 5% chance. 5%? Oh, like 0.5%. Actually, Negative I'm gonna adjust chance. my estimate. Negative 5% chance. Uh, I'm gonna dial on my seat. <laughs> it might like reel back or something, I have no idea. Yeah, that, that does. So now we'll never know who truly won. <laughs> See, it's smart by him, because he's like, we don't know, guys. We don't know. <laughs> we don't know. Could have been me. Could have won. Who's up next? It should be uh, Spandex and Daigoon. Whoever's storing it on the other side. Is that Winner's Finals? No, not Winner's Finals yet. It's 3-1 for Mr. Eco. All right, so now we see what happens when Andrew talks all that shit about how easy a matchup is. The and then gets wiped off the board. He just, he, uh, he just says I was he, better. He also calls me a, uh, what's it called? Uh, Masher. An outlier. Yeah. What? Call me an outlier. I call you an outlier. I don't call him <laughs> an outlier. I've heard you call him a mash 